One Piece is one of the most played games on Roblox and I'm actually tired of seeing so many One Piece games in my feed. But I did have one question in mind. Which One Piece game is the best on Roblox? So today we're ranking every One Piece game that I can find and if I did miss any then please comment down below and I'll make a part 2 of it. Starting off we have the most played One Piece game on Roblox, Bloxroot. Bloxroot always has half a million people playing it every day. Now we all know half these player accounts are probably scripters who are trying to make max level accounts to sell on websites for real cash. Because the last time I played this game, there was at least two scripters or hackers per server and I would just go around killing them for fun. But maybe things have changed and maybe they have a better banning system. But part of this game's popularity also comes from the fact that they have a trading system which people utilize to convert their robux into real cash. Now if you are a brand new player, the start of the game is pretty fun. The skill animations are nice to look at and you can also make a pirate group and play with your friends. It's also enjoyable even if you don't have any friends. But moving forward, the game gets really repetitive. You just take a quest complete the quest level up and repeat that until you reach max level and after that it's just pvp and farming the game does have some content in the second and third seas like raid bosses to awaken your devil fruit but they don't pose any challenge if you have a buddha which is also the best grinding fruit now i'll be honest i do enjoy the pvp a lot so if this was a pvp tier list i would put this game on top but for now it's going down to b tier now let's look at another one piece game called fruit battlegrounds don't let the name battlegrounds fool you because it does not feel like a battle Battlegrounds game. For those of you who don't play Battlegrounds game, it's basically games that are supposed to be fast paced with no grinding required and you only have to compete with each other using your skills. But this game has none of that because unlike Battlegrounds game, you have to spend hours just to unlock all of your fruits skill set. On top of that, if you get a better fruit, you have to repeat the same process. You can also unlock Soru at level 100 and if you roll any mythical fruits, you are leagues above everyone else. Oh and by the way, your HP also scales with your level. So if you're a new player, don't even try to attack a high level player because he's never gonna die so i'd give this game a solid c tier just because the animations are very good now the next game we have is meme seas a game that i've actually enjoyed and this game is not a serious game but it has so many people playing it because it's just blocks fruit but on steroids everything in this game is so easy to get and even as i just started the game i was greeted by high level players dumping their fruits on my face and if you're lucky these high level players will even give you a mythical fruit i luckily got the mythical fruit dog power which allows me to summon a dog stand who does everything for me even the game passes in this game is so cheap that even i can afford them i don't know who made this game but they are extremely generous with almost everything even the player bases are just as generous as the game the game also allows you to level up very quickly so i can see why people enjoy this game and for a game where everything is so easily accessible it also has decent animations and sound effects Okay, I'm just kidding. I think it has decent animations, but sound effects, meh. Now, personally, I would put this as A tier, but that would be an insult to Blocks Fruit. So I'm gonna put this at B tier. The next game we have is One Fruit. Another bandit beater game, but this takes it to a whole new level. At the start of the game, you might notice the eight times XP nice. boost and very generous amounts of berries, which is the in-game currency, but you're gonna find out that that's not enough. The max level for this game is 62,000. And on top of that, you have to grind 100 and 24,000 levels for every stats that you want to max out and there are eight stats that you can grind to max level i personally spent hours grinding and reaching a level of 11,000, and i still haven't started enjoying the game why because all the raid bosses that i want to fight and grind have 700 billion hp at the minimum this game is extremely grindy and i recommend you to only play it if you are willing to spend half your lifespan trying to get to max level so i'm gonna put this game at b tier so far we haven't really found any s tier or a tier one piece games so we'll keep searching the next game we have is grand piece online and i think you guys will hate me for what i have to say about this game this game is also a bandit beater type of game and it used to be pay to play but now it's free the start of the game was pretty nice and i really enjoyed the town's look and the fighting style but this game is grindy as f the npcs can actually fight back and you might have a hard time if you're kind of new to the game this game wants you to grind just as hard if not harder than blocks fruit now to be fair if you enjoy very grindy games then i think you can go for this game but it does not benefit any afk players as the npcs can actually kill you if you're not careful so i guess this game also goes into the b tier again now for the last one piece game i found on roblox which is king legacy this is also another bandy beater game but it didn't feel as grindy as the other games i played probably 
because some high level player gave me a paw fruit which made grinding so much easier now the game didn't even feel that bad and it was also very chill it felt exactly like blocks fruit so i'm just gonna give the same rating as blocks fruit so b tier for it too and there you have it that was just the games that i found on roblox and maybe you can help me find even more one piece games but so far we haven't found any game that stood apart from each other except i think i would put grand piece online on a tier because i really enjoyed the combat system and there are also some really good one piece games that are set to release on december which is real seas and this shit well that's all for now i'll be uploading once a week so that i can upload higher quality videos so please like share and subscribe if you enjoyed these videos and i'll see you in the next video